Hey guys, it's Rupith here. I uh, got a sore throat, so the voice will be a bit shaky, but still, let's get on with it. Uh, so I have the Honor 5C as you can see here, and I got an update two days ago of 1.97 GB. It's a big update, and after I updated it, yes, you can see it's a EMUI 5 version and the Android Nougat. So great, Honor is supplying the Android was rolling out the Nougat version on their low range devices. This is only a 10,000, 11,000 rupee mobile. So great. But you get the Volti update here. But the problem is that the Volti won't be active uh, when after the update. You have to activate it from the settings menu. Go to the settings, then go to the mobile SIM management. Okay. No, uh, wait, wait a second. More go to more mobile networks and here you can see mobile data mobile data always on and mobile data volte for calls use volte for hd calls this was not activated now you have to activate it for the volte so that's the first thing so what have been changed with the settings now let's get into something let's see here no i don't think that one apps okay now you can just drag it from here to you can go to any other settings you want to that's a handy feature i guess uh let's see more uh okay now you get a whole app drawer just like the other devices look at this this is the standard one i have in, in here without the app drawer now you have this one the drawer version so now you get an app drawer look at this this, this is smooth huh nice you get the app drawer click on the app drawer yeah it was a little bit stutter there because i just applied it on maybe uh next you get a new uh, feature here on the right hand side just like the google now cards and the google now launcher you get another same feature thing so what's this uh this is powered by app suggestion is on i guess so this news board has been powered by Flipboard, which I really is not uh, not customizable too much. You can just select news from here and, and nothing more than that. You cannot have the scorecards or anything else like that. So it's okay, but I didn't didn't found it too pleasant because <coughs> I didn't use the Google Now launcher. So it's not that much uh, for me maybe you guys will like it i don't know uh, let's change the home app draw style so let's unwind the camera interface and this is the camera interface now uh, it's taking like a bit of time for the camera interface to open every time i'm seeing these lags and it's kind of annoying but still uh, okay this is the camera interface you can see it's changed uh, the front camera has been also changed let's see uh, yeah it's changed so that's the camera interface for now uh, nothing else changed the modes are still there the manual mode and the panorama and the etc are still there everything is looking quite decent on the EMUI 5 version the notification panel has been changed and this is a big change I guess uh, you can edit you can add as many as you can here the quick toggles and as less as you can that's also there <laughs> so the notification will be coming down here and the hook toggles will be there so when you drag it down first time that there will be only this once the primary quick toggles you just need it and you can set as you want to set them and then drag it down for the more uh, this is optimization corner and this has been changed also okay and that's it i guess uh yeah that's it so thanks a lot for watching this video uh put a thumbs up if you liked it put a thumbs down if you didn't and uh, for more subscribe i will be covering more emi emui features and stuff uh so stay tuned bye bye for now